Hi guys, this is a tutorial on how to get auto rotate and multi touch on your G1 phone. Um, for those of you who don't know how these features look like, I'll demonstrate them to you right now. So this is auto rotate right here. See the screen flips automatically. Um, and multi touch, it only works in the um, default Android web browser, so it won't work in things like Google Maps. But uh, this is multi-touch right here. You can zoom the page automatically with two fingers. Uh, sorry if you can't see that really clearly. But uh, if you want to find out how it looks like, I guess you'll have to try it out for yourself. Um, before you can get these features, you have to mod slash jailbreak your phone. Um, I'm not personally going to show you that video. Um, because there's a really good video out there by Cool PS Tuts um, that tells you how to mod your phone. I'll provide the link, of course, um, and that's gonna tell you how to mod your phone for RC33. I provided that link because I suppose that's what everyone has. If you don't have that version, just contact me, and I'll tell you what to do. But uh. Before you mod your phone, you should know that there's a slight chance that your phone could get bricked. But uh, as long as you follow all the steps carefully and uh, take your time, you shouldn't have any problems. I've personally modded my phone about three times by now, and I haven't really had any problems because I follow the steps really carefully. And also, once you go through that installation for modding your phone, you should get multi-touch already by then because that's part of the update. Um, so yeah, um, once you do those updates, um, I'll tell you what to do from there. So once you modded your G1 phone, you can now apply these two features. You should of course already have multi-touch because that was part of the update when you jailbroke your phone. But uh, you'll still have to get the app that enables auto rotate which is called Droid Sans. You can get this from the Android Market. So you go to Market, you open up the search box, you type in Droid Sans. So D R O I D S A N S. You search for that app. You click on the top one with the blue wrench. Droid Sans Tweak Tools should say this application works with modded RC29, RC30, RC33, RC8, UK, and ADP. You install that. I already installed it. Once you do that, go home. Um, then you have to open up Terminal Emulator. Now this is a really important step because a lot of people that download this app and try to enable auto rotate, they say it doesn't work this is the key reason why it doesn't. So once you're in terminal emulator you open up your keyboard and you type in SU. Hit enter. You should see a little, you probably don't see it right now, you should see a pound sign below the SU that you typed in. It might prompt you to say um, to enable this so you say always if it does. Then you go home again. Um, you go to that app, the Droid Sans Tweak Tool. You scroll to the top. Um, you should click Remount as Read slash Write. Then uh, once you do that, you have to click Enable Auto Rotate. Um, and it should prompt you to reboot the phone. So then you, on the very bottom, you hit the Reboot button and your phone should reboot. Once it reboots, you should have Auto Rotate. And yeah, your phone should be able to do this. So yeah, that's all. Please subscribe, comment on how I can improve my videos, ask any questions, and um, that's all.